Hello and welcome back to Prison Architect. Oh, I lost save to my previous game, so we have to start all over. So let's begin. Firstly, let's just quickly remove these rooms and put delivery delivery here like that. Okay. I know what this says, you can pause and read it if you want. It basically explains how to play the game. Okay, let's close intake. Grants. This is basically s like like guidelines that you get to pay like missions and it helps oops, it helps you to get around it, know what to build. So basic detention center and administration center. Let's do that first. Okay, let's see. Let's Firstly, we have to build our utility room. So let's do that like, like there. And the staff room in like that okay next while oops where are all my workers staff don't I have any weird mm, 14 nice um okay are we done? Nice. Let's put power station and water pump in, in as well. Few of these capacitors. Perfect. Now let's build an entrance to the prison. Like we can do this like that and large jail door here now depending on how much power you use this red bar will go up and these capacitors allow you to put more stuff that needs electricity uh, we have to get our power here like that and let's put in a few lights as well so we can see what we are doing okay nice now we have this planning option where you can actually like pull the schematic for what you want to build. So I was thinking we need administration as well. Let's put kitchen somewhere here. We can actually make it two parts. Part canteen, part kitchen. Kitchen can be smaller actually like that what kitchen actually requires nothing special okay that's that's going to be kitchen and this is going to be canteen we're going to put double door here and one door there like that shower holdings okay Oops, one. Sh shower just needs, I think, a shower head. Yes, okay. So, shower can be this. 
that and then this can be our holding zone yeah we can place it right away like that where shower shower is here holding cell is here need office okay need a yard I was planning on building a massive prison, so I was thinking on on massive inner yard, like like real big. So let's start from here. We can make a hallway like this. Then double gel doors here. Then extending out. like this can be our can be our yard actually let's save a bit of resources and just connect it like this okay offices okay so we need offices how large 4x4 four four, okay One, two, three, one, two, three, four. So, wall goes here. All the lights, nice. Four, two, three, four. Wall. One, two, three, four. We, we are we are going to need at least four offices at the beginning. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Five extra okay and let's put the doors here 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 and here um okay we can make this something else later down here we can make solitary confinement so let's just Make it like this three solitary confinements and a double jail door here. Okay, there we go. This is how our prison is going to look. Let's say. Let's firstly put lights there, there, okay. Into this hallway here as well. Okay, we will need a fence around here. Large jail doors here, here. Oh, damn it! I forgot about this. Let's dismantle that. And just put it. Oops. And just put it like here. So this is going to be two solitary confinement cells, and this is going to be an entrance, a holding cell. We will need a bench here. Let's put first. Let's put serving table. Then bin as well. Table. Let's make a double table. Perfect. Kitchen. Uh, stuff doors. Sink. Fridge. Can put the bin here. And a cooker. Oh, it's narrow. Never mind. Okay, what else? Okay, let's actually just bring the water here. So 
I can plan anything else easily. These require water supply and coopers require power supply. Okay, maybe shower heads, yeah. Objects, shower heads. that and we are going to put a drain here and here and regular door here same goes for this they need four offices With a chair, table, and a filing cabinet. Okay, let's make this a yard. Shower is going okay. We need toilets. Nah, let's put them here like that. Perfect. What else do we need? I know, I think that's mostly done. Can sell this. Oh yeah, walls. Almost forgot about that. Perfect. He doesn't have water. Oh, okay, they're still building it. Rooms, garbage. Can make this into garbage. There we go. Uh, yard is going to need a barbed wire so they can jump over fences because that is a thing now quick can actually take him take it we're going to start with minimum sector first and then we are going to move up sectors as I feel let's take two for now as I build prison more. Okay, two guards and two cooks. Two guards, two cook. Lock shut. Okay. Concrete wall here, here. Oh yeah, solitary, solitary. This and then solitary doors. I don't have found shit. Okay, we have to finish this. People don't holding so. Come on, hurry up, please. 
Nice, ten grand. We can build toilets now. Hmm, it's missing power. Can fix that easily. Okay. Nice start. Okay, they are arriving in twelve hours. Let's speed it up a bit. Okay, her awarden exceeds their budget. Shit. Okay. Oh, I think I went a little bit big with start, but okay. Uh, what else is relatively easy? Prison maintenance. Yeah, this is this is useful. Oh, we're going to have to wait till ends uh, till the end. Then we are going to hire ourselves a warden. Mm, her garden. Okay, we have to research them through here, and that won't unlock yet. Also, okay. Come on. What? I still can hurt him? Damn it. Okay, we are going to need to take a bit of other prisoners as well. So we can hurt a warden, which we really need. Or actually, we can just fire a few. Workman. What about now? Oh yeah. Okay. Let's turn this off. We have a warden now. Now we can unlock, unlock a tech tree, let's say, which allows you to have a lot of other options. Like we can get that row. And we have to execute him later. Guard tower, dog surveillance, and other interesting stuff. But for now, we have to research finance. And he's now researching, as you can see. Sport. Do we have any lights in here? I don't. I don't think we do. Oh yeah, one useful thing: you can make this utility room always a storage like that so they will move boxes and such into storage so they don't just lie around we can actually make this um, stuff room we have stuff yeah we do let's make that a stuff room how large does it have to be stuff room 4x4 four four. this will do White sofa, drinking machine. Okay, so in the staff room, staff will will relax because I enabled the option where you need to satisfy staff as well, or they will go on on protest and won't won't work, which isn't too good. Oh, they are running in two hours. Nice. What else can we put them here? Large TV, why not? Actually, maybe something more useful. 
the serving table, which doesn't fit. Nice. Okay, we'll, we'll fix it later. Not big of a trouble right now. Still is almost done. Nice. Okay, first intake is coming soon. You will see they will arrive by prison bus in here. Prison intake. Here we go. Here they come. Now a guard will go and escort them in. And you can actually see what they're ser I mean somebody uh, you can see what they're sentenced for and someone some of them will have a, like a long history and you have to be careful about ex law enforcement and snitches because every other prisoner is trying to kill them he's seven years here as well nothing special what you can do, which is really useful, is just search the prisoner because they they more more than often come with some illegal stuff in. Mm, he's clear. We're going to leave this lock open so it doesn't have to open all the time. This is well actually. And he is clear as well. You have the shakedown option, and then police officers will shake down everything that could be holding potential contrabands. Okay, what else do we need to do? Hire an accountant. Okay. He's researched that. Accountant. There you go. Uh, let's unlock maintenance and cleaning because our prison is starting to get dirty. Good. They haven't found anything illegal and let's put serving table here now so staff can eat oh okay that's that now we should getting should g be planning next step to expanding our prison i was thinking since my plan is to have like a large yard in the center to have like one block here one block here and one block here and then we can extend this to be a visitation and workshop and etc then we can have like that row here or we can actually expand in them even more later on into these black areas now but this is a general idea what to do i think we should start like somewhere like here it's something a little like this with cell blocks and then we can go even larger so we have a money for it let's see ah not exactly oh notebook page um you can find these pages like um, lying around and you also have like this Polaroids that you can unlock through doing story mode and just lying around sometimes. Okay. 
our prisoners are doing what? Just chilling. Okay, that's fine. I'm waiting for our maintenance to unlock and then I will unlock prison labor so I don't actually have to hire cleaners, I can just hire them because they're cheaper. Okay, regime. Actually, I could change the regime a little bit. They not do not need to eat for two hours because canteen is closed. So let's make this another shower time. Yard is okay. Bring this one last shower before sleep. I can go sleep at 10. 7 a.m. Welcome, that's okay. Shower. Let's make another meal here. Lock up. Actually, work free time. Get this work lock up. Nice. Let's make that like that. Okay, they're eating now. Can I have a guard here? I need to unlock uh, deployment so they just won't wander around. I, I can actually deploy a certain amount of guards in each room. That will be useful. Ooh, I just realized I'm missing a wall here. Okay, shower time for them. Finance can actually research just a grant so we can take both uh one more grant speaking of grant let's still okay raise your prison capacity to 15. let's do that and now we can do this first we have to build a foundation to build one boom let's make an entrance here they're cold yeah we have actually weather weather so let's micromanagement okay with this we can see a temperature in prison and a lot of lot more let's hire our foreman foreman can now research prison labor we are off to a good start really fast and i like that okay utilities electrical cable like this this low coupon until they build everything they need to build and actually let's just quickly put water boiler here so we can get some hot water in there nice and let's build a few radiators one here here, we can go here. Another one can go there. That would be very nice if I could actually see where they are. Better. One is somewhere. There it is. Uh, the thing with this water. Um, hot water pipes are the longer they are without this boiler the water will actually get cold so you need to build another boiler they have a certain amount of range that you can actually pull of them before they the water loses its temperature okay it's a res oh extra grand nice let's take bank loan in case we need it 
we can do all this later. Okay, so okay. Um, planning. Cell block requires two by three. So I want to buy more walls and doors. This is a relatively small canteen. So I was thinking, what if we, what if we do? Like canteen somewhere here. How large does it have to be? Doesn't have any requirement requirements. Okay. Let's make this cell block A canteen. This is going to be a cell block A. No, nah, scrap this. Nah. Uh, two by three, two by three. We will need a let at least fifteen of this, and we are going to build a shower somewhere here as well and okay now one room of space and we go down two by three one two three line like that okay i think this is more than enough for first episode we have two prisoners waiting for their cells to be built we have a basic prison going on and see you next time thanks for watching and bye